Hello once again, ladies and gentlemen, Miss Lunaria here as always. Welcome back. We are about to get oil processing. Fucking hit it, Matt. Let's go. Sorry, I was checking out the truck. I'm coming. Well, I thought yeah. you were over there. I was at the truck. I was saying hi. Oh, whatever. Three, two, one. Oil. Milestone reached. Oil acquisition and refining unlocked. Oil-based products can now be made. The byproducts of oil refinement can be used after further processing, as seen in the refinery. Caution. This is a reminder to minimize the chance of expiration during out-of-base activities. So, did you think that this, uh... If you think that this coal shit is spaghetti... Um... Yeah. Look at the manufacturer. That's in the next milestone that we got unlocked. I mean, we got half of those things. What do you mean? Like, are you talking about, like, the in the next milestone, what we have to make? Yes. Well, we got wires and we got motors now, so... What yeah. I'm saying is, you know how spaghetti that is? How spaghetti you can get with just, like, a no. set of and all that? I've never played this game before. <laughs> I've never gotten this far. So I don't I know. know. But I'm saying, is look up there. You know how it's all spaghetti, which is like the assemblers and all that, the two input, one output shit. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you get to the manufacturer, it's a, uh, it's four inputs per one output. Jesus. All right. That's you. You're gonna need another level to that factory. You're gonna need to make a completely new one. Probably just want another level would be what I guess. Yeah, that's probably what I'm gonna do. Yeah. We can all build up, but it's just that much more pain in the ass to transport shit from one place to another. Well, it could all also right, well. still expand to the side, because there's all that room off to the left there. Yeah, we definitely could. Alright, I'm just finishing up what I'm doing over here, and then we'll go check out coal stuff. Cool. Coal stuff? Yeah, coal stuff. Coal or not, stuff. not, not coal yeah, stuff. Coal stuff. Coal. Oil, oil stuff. Oil. Oil stuff. Liquid coal. Liquid gold. Yeah. <laughs> gold. All right, so this needs. Speaking of which, rotors. what are we gonna need? What are we gonna need? Oil extractor. Oh, we need more motors. Refineries, more motors. Of a bitch, so many motors, so much encased industrial beams. All right, um, so all we can make right now is rubber, plastic, and fuel. Okay, and circuit boards. Oh, we're gonna need a valve, too, probably. Okay, valves, valves are interesting. Yeah. Those limit a pipeline's flow rates. Why would you need to do that? I have no clue. I'm literally just reading it. It's my first time reading it. Hmm. <laughs> Petroleum coke. A carbon rich material distilled from heavy oil residue. Oh, so when you're crafting such stuff like plastic and rubber, or do you get, like, residue and stuff that you can use to craft other things? Maybe? That's what it sounded like. We're gonna need to bring so much shit over. <laughs> I need I need to make more motors. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm setting up motors right now to be pumping out, so... Alright, we're gonna need, like, upwards of 100 motors, probably. Probably won't go too crazy with the oil, but you never know, because, like I said, it's my first oil, so it's kind of hype. Pretty much hype. How many steel beams do I have? 600, that should be enough. Five power Wait. shards, more than enough. That's wrong. Shit. What? I did it wrong. 
I just, boy goo. I just piped the wrong fucking thing in. Yes, you did. You did automated wiring. Because I'm a big dummy. This automated wiring. You're like, going to need to. This automated really wiring. About. What? In order to get to the automated wiring that's actually in the machine. Oh. Alright, statters. Anyway, were... we can just. Where the fuck were statters? A tours, right here. Actually, I already have them split here. And they're backing up. Yeah, here they are. Let's right create that conveyor belt, shall we? Since they're backing up so much, you can put a split on this conveyor right here and probably split this one lane into six different inputs, if you know what I mean. Yeah, that is a smarter thing to do. Let's see, you're using, yeah, two and a half a minute for those, so that equals seven and a half, and these are ten per minute. So. 40 and a half staters per minute, and these things can pipe up to 270 a minute. And there we go. And this will create five per minute. So 15 motors a minute going on over here. I'd like to see that. About to be a lot more, boy. Oh, would you like to see how big an oil extractor is? Sure. Can yeah. you see me? Yeah, that's not that big, but that's pretty cool looking though. Okay, now refinery. Ah, uh, refinery's big. Yeah. Just wait till you see the manufacturer. I cannot wait to unlock that. Just slapping some power shards in here. I'm so excited for all this new stuff. I haven't done any of it. Yeah, you rejoined at the right fucking moment. Yes, I did. I need a hiatus because I I was like playing on like three different worlds. That's that's completely fair. No, oh, I just got mine up to basic oil is where I stopped. So like once we pass this first milestone, we'll be completely caught up to me. Nice. On my world, and then. On your world and my friend's world, pretty much played up through coal. At least the basic coal on this world and then on my other... You're just everywhere, man. ...friend's world, I was up through, like, nearly oil. But as you can tell, it was a lot of repetition. Now it's just ready for something new. Yeah, I, I completely but Here understand. we are, and I couldn't be more excited. As you know, I also get burned out, so I, I understand completely. And that was after like 40 hours and like two weeks of playing. Gotcha. So yeah. it, was a, it wasn't like I wasn't playing. It was a bit much. I was. We're gonna need some pipes too, some steel pipes. We have a little bit here. That actually probably will be enough for our needs if yeah. you don't have any on you. I have some on me, but those two things that container of steel beams and that container of steel pipes that's just not going to go anywhere that's just going to be produced for personal use Love that. so yeah all right so i have about a hundred and third i have about 330 pipes about 600 beams a lot of copper sheet about a little over a thousand concrete a little over 200 rods a little over 300 plates iron iron plates a little on over 200 reinforced iron plates 51 motors, some quick wire, a lot of quick wire, oh crap, a lot of cable. I'm just making sure I have everything we, we're gonna need. Yeah. Okay, maybe more cable, because each oil extractor is 60 cable. Jesus Christ, okay. I think we have enough for at least basic stuff. Are we going to need motors at all? Or not motors, uh, yes. uh, rotors? Rotors? I didn't see anything that needs to be created with the rotors, but it's not completely out of the realm of possibility. Okay. Speaking of which, where are you stockpiling those suckers? 
the rotors? Yeah. Up top. Oh, I see. Right here. Right here. We are uh, uh, getting low on rotors now that we're using the wall. Really? Yeah, we're using all the rotors. Just each each motor uses 25 rotors a minute, so we're using 75 rotors a minute just on the motors. We can up the power. And source. we're only creating like 15 a minute. So if you want to keep up with the rotor with the motor production, we're gonna to need to yeah. up I, the rotor production. I just slapped in a bunch of power shards. That even if they're fully maxed out, they'll be making like thirty-seven point five a minute. Hmm. All the three of these combined, which is half of what the motors are taking. Do we need motors that bad right now? We don't need too many. I have enough for a long while. So if you want to pause production, you can. And well, just it's, stack it's, up it's, on not, it's not pausing production. I'm just going to have one power shard in each one. So instead of producing five per minute, or instead of producing 12 per minute, it'll pr produce like seven and a half, which their base was five. You know? 20 per minute on each one, which is 60 rotors per minute total. Well, I'm, I'm just taking out the power shards so they consume less, but they don't produce as many motors anymore. You're still going to be using 100% of the rotors that you're creating, though. Really? Uh, uh, 15 per minute. We could have one machine going right now and just pause the other two. No. Uh, yeah, 15 per minute. Ah, fuck, I guess. Yeah, you don't need motors that bad. Like, motors are just used to create stuff, and I have plenty. I have over 100 motors. All right, then, yeah, I'm going to pause, pause two. Because I want, I want... If, oh. if we do need rotors, we're not going to have any. Yeah. Luckily, I didn't see any recipes that require rotors right now, but, yeah. Now this copper wire is getting low. Copper wire? Oh, just the production I've got going on down here. It's getting low. Remember the recipe we unlocked? Oh yeah, it is deuterium. Deuterium, yep. We're literally not using it right now. Nah, I'm just slapping power shards in this right now, for now. Just because it's right. easy. Alright, didn't we Shall see we? a bunch of oil? Somewhere? Yes. Yep, I know where it is. We just need to make sure we bring uh, the power out with us. So we don't need to come all the way back. Oh, yeah. Um, I'll go make grab... Make sure we're connecting lines all the way out there. Yeah, I'm going to go grab some cable. Uh, I got like 600 cable on me. I'm also gonna grab another stack. That's all some of the recipes use quite a bit. Also, look at the next milestone when you have 1,000 cable just for the upgrade. No, we got, we're producing And 100 more. motors. Oh yeah, that's where most of the motors go, is to the upgrade, the milestones. Okay. The building shit and then a lot of the milestones. Now, this is the first tier. And it's taking a hundred motors. All right, so where are you at? You up top? Yep. The oil is out this way. I think that like stopped me in the air. Where's the nearest, uh, hole? Nearest hole? Hole. Oh. Like... I want to bring the power with us, if you know what I mean. Oh, the pole. 
Yeah, like I want a power line all the way out to where we're going. Um. Kind of pull. Yeah, right up Ooh, there. Ooh, pull. Right there. All right, I got it. All right, let's go. Hype. I'm following you. or oil is like a kilometer away. It's a, it's a little ways. But it's, there's one I know for a fact that's pure, if not two of them. Okay. Oops. So it's pretty freaking good. I'm pretty sure there's four of the coal spots. Oh yes, yeah, so this guy respawned. Wire too long. There we go. Holy shit, he almost killed me. I need to put better food on my hot bar. Well now I've killed him. I look away for a second, he brings me down to two hearts. Jesus. Gosh dang it, where is it? Can't wait till we get trains. I like trains. Unfortunately, we already ways off trains. I know. But I am so excited for when we get there. I want trains now. Hopefully not all the enemies respawn. Hopefully. That would suck. Yeah, I remember that oil being like just crawling with fuckers. Yeah, that's why I'm hoping that it's not completely uh, crawling again. Because that guy respawned. We 100% killed him before. Yeah. yeah. The oil's over this way now. This way. So glad I discovered this like exploit. <laughs> All right, here's a moment of truth. Did they respawn? Here's a normal node. There's a node over yep. here. Yep. All these guys did. Normal node. I know where a pure note is. Ow. I think I just hit you. Yep. <laughs> I'm a bitch. Alright, so the pure note is right across the water over here. Yep. This is a good one. Yep, right here. Big boy respawned. Why is there just a flying dude here? Freaking ace. I won't die. Alright, so the what I did the first time is I just built a huge ass platform out over this water because I thought it looked cool. Yeah, you didn't do anything, uh 
You didn't build it on this flat area here? This area is pretty flat. Also, I was trying to think to the future. If I built up over the water, I thought maybe one day I would just connect it to the other side. Uh... Be like a big ass bridge. Hold on, Going like this way. But we can do whatever you think would look best. Truth be told, I kind of find the foundations ugly. I don't think they look very good. They're, this game's clearly not... It's not designed for good looking. Yeah. So I don't know, I feel like the natural look kind of looks nicer. Because when you start building like the big factory, just everything is gray. And it kind of sucks. Now, you can change that because you can make a pink on a paint shit. Ah, oh, shit, I didn't bring motors with me. I did. I'm coming. I was just killing things. Fuck. Like the one thing needed. Oh, I don't have proper sheets it. either. Shit, I really didn't come up prepared. I got sheets. Here, I'll drop some. You drop me a couple motors. Thank you. Yep. I just want to see what this refinery is like. So, you do have to be careful because there are two sides where there's two inputs and two outputs. Okay. One for each, one for water and uh, resources, and the other side for water and resources. So, when I was building my first time, I got these turned around. I had the inputs and the outputs, and it fucked up the whole thing for like 30 minutes. Okay, I see. So we want to be making plastic. Yep. Plastic, rubber, and fuel. Like that, we need to be making all of that? Well, you're going to want fuel for sure. It's just nice to start stockpiling yeah. now. Oh, um, can I bring it up for shoot? Fluid buffer, I did, okay. I can make some fluid buffers. Just trying to think of how to set this up. Ooh, another thing I didn't think of. How much uh, extra space do we have for the uh, power? What do you mean? Like, how much space do we have from how much power we're making to how much we're using? Ah, uh, that's a good fucking question. I guess I just upgraded it. Okay, so on average, we're using about between 1,700 and 1,500, or 1,300. And we can hold... Yeah, we got plenty of space. Sweet. Sweet. How do you want this to look, I guess, is what I'm wondering. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to figure out right now. Um... Fuck. Okay. Um... I really should have brought copper sheets with me, just so I could, like, fiddle this shit, but I don't want to take all your crap. Okay. Just because I came unprepared. I guess... I still have, uh, 325 copper sheets. So plastic can also be made from polymer, resin, and water. Which you'll turn in crude. So I think we need to be making this plastic first. And that will give us heavy oil residue as well. And we'll also need oil. We'll also need uh, rubber, right? Yeah, we do need yep. rubber. That's rubber up there. Yep. So I guess... I'm heading over. We're gonna need two of those, three, two to three of those to get started. Yeah. Where's the refinery? There's the refinery. So you just want to build on land then? Yeah, I, I feel it makes it look nicer. And this area is already pretty freaking flat, so. Alright. This side by side is ideal. 
Also, let me say you uh, got the wrong end facing this way. Shit. Yep. <laughs> I did that the first time too. Okay. Alright, so. Oil so, extractor, we probably want a facing. Is that the right way? That way. Because one of these can easily fuel like three of these, easily. Because it's pure oil. Okay, so, so pump out a lot. what other recipe could we be making? Um, fuel. Fuel. We can start stockpiling fuel. Yeah. What I'm gonna do right here. Where is it? Logistics. I'm gonna put a cross junction here and try to line it up with this one as best I can. Okay. But, um, before we get too far bring here. This, bring this over. And then we got our little cross here we can split into three. Yes. And we shouldn't need any pumps, right? Because there's no lifting. Literally none. I believe so. Alright, well. That is all the time I have for today, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for watching, and as always, have a lovely day.